Oh, Flamey Blade. What is up, friend? Because our hand is not great. Ooh. So we're going to put back on the Geist Chandlers. Geist Chandler, low key good in this deck. Also, low key awkward. Might not be the get best Geist Chandler home. I think making divide by zero one mana spell is probably best for us long term. We're working towards Leer. Okay, maybe I should have bolted the bird. <laughs> this back in their hand. Do I teach into the archaic? It actually might just be teaching, so I just kinda need cards. Which is kinda wild. Mmm. This card's so good right there. Holy cow. Remember that time I greedily got teachings of the archaic? <laughs> and just got absolutely rightfully punished a second later? I legitimately love that. I could loot away teachings of the archaic. I'd like the sciences and hope they can't commit too much more to the board. <laughs> Alright. It's a little awkward. I'm gonna grab this island so we can thirst for discovery it away. But I think I just want to power kill this Katilda while I have the chance. hard to know exactly what I need to be fighting over, but I know I can't kill this. And I think I can just deal with this card's taxation at this point. Of course, the tax messes up after I say that. Alright, throws for discovery. If I decline, I have to discard, like, Consider teachings. Uh, it's kind of awkward. All right, we're gonna awkwardly play this said more witch. Oh, we can't play this on a trite. Oops, <laughs> misclick. Discover the form might just be too much. Mana to actually ever work into the deck. I need to find a kill spell here. Okay. Four, seven, nine, thirteen. Fourteen. Well, that Inquisitor Captain is really good here. Winning this game is going to be brutal. I'm just gonna actually die to the. Hi. Like grabbing that teachings was embarrassing, but we're over it. We moved on. The rest is are really bad, so I'm gonna bring in these two white hate spells. And I think the rest of our deck is kind of fine against it. It's a little greedy, but I kind of actually like it. Like, we've got a lot of looks at cards, so. Had it the whole time. No problems here. Yep. Now we're getting environmental sciences off this card. Easy game. Easy game inbound. I was never worried. Oh, I just... You know, I had the 
the black mana the whole time. I really want to test the, maybe a deck with more big spells in Geist Channeler. Like Windfall with this card's good. Uh, the, the card we have it already with it is pretty good too. I'm gonna let it resolve and just unsummon and get the actual scry. Looking for some power cards. I guess we get to get Mascot Exhibition. And then we get to lower it to uh, three mana. Not gonna fall for teachings of the archaic again. <laughs> Alright. I wonder if they can see that it costs less now. That's an interesting thing that hasn't come up for me yet in this format. I imagine they don't because the game just lets them know I have this card. They don't know what the actual text on the new version of the card is. Size of denial? Okay. Glad that we waited. <laughs> Okay. Now we draw the Leer. The game ends. If we draw the formula, we're in a pretty good spot. A lot of great draws from here. Okay. No creature lands in bossing say, I'll tell you that. And that's game. Our front looks at it like a pretty clunky draw. But it's gonna have a really hard time ever recovering from this. I'll take Teachings of the Archaic. It will work this time. <laughs> Even if you go land thing, I'm good. Yeah. So they can get Brutal Cathar here, eat the 4-4. Four four. They have two blockers, block these two, go to two. I guess they block this and this and go to one, because it's flying. Oh, life lake's pretty good. We'll take our draw three. What? They have Four more cards. Oh. They did. What? If your opponent has at least four more cards than you. I don't know what I did wrong. <laughs> I mean, we won, so it's like, you know, not the end of the world, but... I don't know what I did wrong. That's five cards, right? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I'm here for alchemy content, not counting content. <laughs> this hand needs a little bit of help, but I think it's pretty good. Kind of hoping to draw lands off the top or whatever, but. Play your Catilda. Hopeful initiate. Normally I wouldn't be so gung-ho about doing this, but I think my next couple of turns are spoken for. And ideally I draw a witch off the top, so... If they want to take the consider so that I don't have a play this turn, that's fine with me. I imagine it's just Leer or Soren, most likely Leer, but we'll see. Power kill, sure. Got 
going to use our life total a little bit of a resource here. Hopefully they play something like Katilda. Because they play a Katilda. Ooh, Adelaine. This one's also good for me to unsummon. Oh, it's whenever... Mm. Alright, that was bad. But, it's fine. We go power through these trying times. It does really suck, though. Like, now our Soren's gonna die instead of, you know, not dying. <laughs> yeah. Okay, friend. Use this as a chance to gain a little life back. I think we're just gonna kill this and then play this land tapped. And now our opponent's in a pretty awkward spot. And we're setting up Leer plus Fading Hope so that our Leer like survives. Okay. Oh. It's gonna be hard to set up Leer plus Fading Hope now. <laughs> They slam. I think we trade with the three one. Yeah. This way, their mana sinks are a little worse. We could draw formula. We have Leer, so like, not dying kind of important. Alright, if we're gonna tap, we win. You have to have an answer to this layer. And it can't be like a Brutal Cathar. If it's a Brutal Cathar, I'm, I'm okay. Well, Redain really loses its value against Geist Chandler. Which is like another reason I love Geist Chandler. Malevolent Hermit. A little awkward. Well, that's really good. I'm gonna play this just so we have the cheaper divide by zero. One, two, three, four, five. So I can do this twice. So I can use this, this, kill spell, unsummon. Do I wanna lead on the kill spell now? Yes. There's no reason to do anything. It's gonna be really, really awkward. Kill this. Kill this. I mean, our opponent's in kind of a terrible spot now. Glass pool mimic. All right, so it's gonna enter as Inquisitor Captain. Yeah. Maybe I was supposed to unsummon the divine. I think I wanted to protect Lear. Because Lear kind of conquers all, but maybe that's wrong. It's kind of weird. Is our opponent like. Okay. Sorry, friend. That sucks. Been there before. Let's lead on consider and see what happens. That was a good one. So we will pop this, then just wait. Were they trying to like get a flyer? They're just acting that way. Mascot exposition. Environmental sciences. Alright, one, two, three. One, two, three, one. Okay. Oh, we won. <laughs> we were gonna mask up probably there and just, you know, the board's super stable and it's really awkward. Yeah, that's great. Well, these kind of hands are appealing. I don't know. 
it's hard for it to go too bad. I think they know I have a consider or a fading hope when I have a stop. <laughs> it's too, uh, too lazy to actually fix it. Oh, let's go. It's actually a little dirty how good this deck is. This is pretty anti what I, my spirit of alchemy was, but I, you know, sweaty gamers gotta win sometimes. It sucks a little bit that this ramps them towards a uh, Ren in 7, but if they play Ren, I'd actually be pretty happy, which is a weird place to kind of feel, but the Sedgemore Witch will actually attack and kill the Ren, and I have the, blood th the Bloodthirst for the token, so. Briarbridge Trekker. This is a Blizzard Brawl. Snake skin veil me. I'll concede. <sighs> Alright, sometimes I keep it 99. Sometimes I be lying. Alright. Well, we've got this consider. So we can we can maybe go off. If we go the draw the refill our hand card, the Geist Chandler is very nice. Solve the formula, I believe. What's the card's name? There's a real question. That's so funny. Alright. all that out man. <laughs> all righty it's awkward I I guess we just have to keep this card Yeah, this is, I always think that card is Trample. I don't know why I think that, but I do. Man, I can do that. Sorry to make you do so much work. Solving a problem on the fly. Not even sure you'll see this video. They're going to make another token, but I think it's fine. They have so much mana that that part's never going to come up, so I'm going to hold this for the thirst. Then I think I'm supposed to attack. I have fixed the fuzz. It's gone. Don't ask how we did that. Neither here nor there. Twitch chat doesn't need to know. Outland Liberator. It's an instant or sorcery. Violence is necessary to set 
Okay, well, we're, we're kind of schmoovin'. I'm gonna continue to hold this for Thirst. Because if we draw Thirst, that, that is our best chance to come back in this. That and Leer. This is lifelink, yeah. Alright, our opponent is a little incognito right now. I can block like this, and I, oh, I die. I guess losing the game is pretty bad. They're probably gonna kill the witch. I guess I'm actually supposed to do it like this. This actually makes the most sense. Don't know what I was thinking before. I was thinking the witch was a 2-2, but whatever. Well, this is the card I was holding on this card for. Uh, we're just gonna die. So bringing in the dragon and the two disdainful strokes, cutting. I think I just wanna. It's so awkward. I'm just gonna go down to one, discover the formula. It is six mana do nothing, but with Leer it's so strong, and if you can accelerate it out with the one three, it's absurd. The one three is also really good with divide by zero. I mean, the one the one three is just really good with Leer. That's just the, the secret. All right. Wow, our opponent's bat isn't even a blood bat. Rest up, friend. We're just gonna act cool. Nothing to see. Just hanging out. Just vibing. I actually probably want the land because I need to get my five drops. Yeah, I can turn this into a one with the channeler. Do I just want Blood Chief's Thirst the 2-2? Two -two? Because this lets us hold up all of our interaction and have the stroke live on the turn's going to be the most live. We kind of got our opponent in the bind, they just don't know it. I'm gonna take the four. Mascot? This feels so weird to take Mascot, but it costs, it's gonna only cost five with the Geist Chandler, so it is a little cracked. All right, well now we just hit them for one because they're not blocking anytime soon, and we move on. Ooh, that was bad. Because now they can deploy a two drop. So that was some bad sequencing. I don't know. Yeah, I just let them level up. But. We did kind of get to the exhibition. So we'll, we'll take it. Lizard Brawl. 
That's rude. The problem is the card has trample. So like chump blocking it here is essentially gaining life, which we'll gain on the next turn as well. So I think I want to know it. Which low key sucks, but. Now we're a little, a little white on land at the moment. I mean, Snake Skin Veil just beats us here, straight up. Yep. Crazy. Well, I did say I wanted to play the Sedgemore Witch deck, so I guess with Triple Witch, I'll keep. <laughs> it's a little awkward, but if we draw some lands, we'll be fine. Alright, we're going to fire off Duress, because if it's Mono Green, traditionally Duress is actually quite good at messing up their curve. Alright. Well, a Worse Chariot is still pretty good to get. And we're just going to hit this land off the Scry here. Easy game. Like I said, draw it now. Okay, close. Okay, well the game just wanted to make it close. So, uh, <laughs> we'll just play our Sedmer Witch a turn late. Our opponent is probably gonna play this Mammoth. Yep. Alright. So we need to decide do we want to kick it to get remove presence now? Or do we want to. I think we're supposed to develop Second Witch here. Actually, we're probably actually supposed to kick and just get rid of the Mammoth. So we've got the Leer, and now we got this little Trump Blocker. But maybe we're supposed to go to the Troll. I was thinking we wanted to keep the Troll around so they couldn't have extra mana and make more Trolls, but... Alright, well. My Power Word kill is pretty good. I guess we'll play the Sedmore Witch. So actually, we're kind of winning this race. Like, we're going to take three, uh, seven here. And then we'll power word kill. And we'll get two chump blockers that are gaining us two life. And it'll be kind of hard for them to catch up. And if we draw a lane, we get to go Witch plus this. Which is pretty absurd. That's a pretty good one. It's a little awkward to let them draw, like if they have main deck snake skin veil or something, it might be a problem, but we'll still make the three one ones, so. I hope this isn't pestering you. I'll see y'all in the next video. I understand why you left. Yeah. No, I, I would too. Mm -hmm. No, don't don't have to apologize. Yep, I understand. But no, we're gonna fading hope and attack. All right. Well, that was pretty good. Definitely would have been in trouble on the draw there, but we weren't. It's a little awkward. I know traditionally I would have brought in actually negate. But I guess they still had the Asika's Chariot. Nah, I think I'm actually fine with what we have right now. Maybe the Desert Doom can come in. I, I do think we want these duresses to clear snakeskin veils and stuff. I have this Field of Ruin, which is actually kind of good in this matchup too, so... 
Do I hit a Ranger class? Ranger class is the best two job they can play. I have Blizzard Brawl. I'm not upset to hit that one. Their hand is so spell light right now that I think giving them a chance to use any sort of snakeskin veil is pretty bad. So, Besides, you know, gotta let them know who's on top. I'm top dog. And we'll wait. Maybe they'll play around like a divide by zero. Ooh, the new foretell card. Card's good. I guess our opponent doesn't know. I have plenty of black. So I shoot it like this. And I can fading hope back the four four. Awkward because if I don't, if I do it beforehand, they get to still attack because it's the beginning of combat, so the trigger won't happen. But I'm sorry, uh, I can't miss them getting the trigger. So kind of in that one last turn. So I play this, I block here, I lose. These are fours. All right, game three. Did that change anything? Maybe these disable strokes are a little better than I was thinking they were. And these blood chief thirsts are a little awkward. Not want to go blank. So yeah, in two stroke, out two blood chief. Well, this hand's insane. It's not actually broken, but uh, I think it's pretty good. Getting to curve this new card that decreases the cost by two on the thirst of discovery. Before discovery, sorry, is really strong. I guess I maybe need to make that a blue and I could draw a swamp, so we'll play this. Bam. Alright, well. We're gonna get like Witch into Thirst and to get two pests. Game's probably over. I should put that in black. But. Okay. Is this a blizzard ball or anything? Oh, discard that basic. They have snakeskin veil, then they have snakeskin veil. Yup. Well. Okay. Seven them. I'll just hold on to this because I could draw something that I want to play. Or maybe I need to discard this to like the Thirst Discovery after we play this Leer. This is Trample, right? So they might put the counter on it. Right. Yeah, that's just what this deck kind of does. 